Welcome to Gemini Jets 2006. Today I'm going to be reviewing the Alaskan Airlines 737 MAX 9. Um, if you notice, it is different. I'm at my mom's house, and usually I film at my dad's house. Um, but plus side is I get this ceramic reviewing plate, and I have a cat to be interrupting my videos. Uh, like I said, today I'm reviewing the Boeing 737 MAX 9. Starting with the box on the front. Um, Alaska logo, Boeing 737 MAX 9, 1400 scale die cast model. On the side, has the item number, computer generated image. The top, the Gemini Jets logo, adult collectible model. On the side, uh, same as the other side, computer generated image. On the bottom, same as the top. And then, um, here is a computer-generated image of the aircraft climbing. As real as it gets, highly collectible, superior quality, realistic metal landing gear, detailed printed graphics, as real as it gets. Um, some information about German jets and little copyright and trademarks. So let's open this up. So usually I have a shelf or something that I can point down to get me opening the box. But, um, I don't have that here. I'm going to have to open this up one-handed with the camera. So it won't look as good as it normally does. But it will do the trick. And there it is. I can do this one-handed. There is the model. Let's pop this little bit of plastic off. Here, I'm going to move both my hands. So I uh, finally got the uh, packaging off. So here it is in its little tray. Um, so I'm going to take this little sheet off. And there is the aircraft. Move that out of the way. Take this little bit of plastic off, and luckily it's not damaged. I've heard people comment that 737s often come damaged, but this one looks in good condition. Um, the front landing gear looks a little big. That looks, I'm not sure how accurate that is. Look at it from the front. Pretty good for the size. Um, so let's do the review. The uh, Alaskan Airlines tail is the Eskimo with the little outline around his head and um, transitions to white there. The uh, engines detailed inside. Uh, an antenna. Um, all the windows, Alaska logo, the engines, the um, wing tips, will focus. Yeah, the iPhone isn't too good with focusing, but maybe I'll get a professional camera. Um, there's the nose. I'm gonna do it like this. There's the nose. You can see the uh, windshield wipers. And the doors. Um, there are cargo doors printed on there. Um, on the bottom. There is little simulated holes for the landing gear, the uh, Gemini Jets logo right there. Yeah, it's too small for my camera to pick up. Little hole for the stand. Um, 
The front landing gear doesn't spin, but the rear landing gear does. I don't know why that is. Um, so, yeah, that was the Alaskan Airlines 737 MAX 9. Um, I am uh, working on right now a... I'm going to make some cardboard terminals. We're spray painting them right now. And they will be the domestic for my New Haven Airport. This is a uh, American Penny next to the aircraft. Um, so as you can see, pretty small. Um, got this on eBay for $35. Um, so yeah, this is Joe Nidget 2006, signing off.